Hi, my name is Jeff Schreyer, and I'm a sales rep for Mid-America Clutch Company. And today I'm in Evansville, Indiana, home of Mid-America Clutches. Indiana has always been known to be the heartland of America. We have good, hard-working people who take great pride in their workmanship. And that is why Mid-America Clutch is the best clutch in the United States. Now we're going to go inside. Now we're inside Mid-America Clutch. And I'd like to introduce to you the president of Ben America Clutch, Mr. Scott Snyder. And also this gentleman right here. This is Dwayne. He's the head of the spice department. He's been with Ben America for 27 years. And now I'll turn it over to you guys. What we're showing you is this cement bark machine that sets up the spicer type clutches and actuates them just like they're in the semi. Go ahead and set it up. We actually use the disc we're going to use, the center plate we're going to use with the cover as a maximum. That's what he's doing now. What this gauge is showing, it's pulling back like it's in a truck. And once, once this gauge is flush up here, you'll have your proper distance underneath the housing. So he'll go ahead and adjust it at this point. you have your gauge is flush so you've got your half inch underneath the housing and it's pulling it back half an inch to check for release it's got a ton of release working properly he marks the adjusting lock so we can tell if it's been tampered with Adjuster's installed. the inside bushings before it's shit. That's actually his initial on the bag. At this point, he's checking the center plate for proper clearance with the feeler gauge and marks it the way he's checked it with blue paint, which is where you should install that center plate during installation.
now we're in the boxing area and I wanted to show how we package our clutches and how they're not physically handled at this point. So go ahead and start loading the top. They're actually packaged on the skid that you receive them on. We do not move them after they're loaded at this point. We have arrows on the boxes that need to be pointed up to eliminate breakage. Um, the clutches should not be stored on their sides or rolled in the back of pickups. They will break. We have double uh, cardboard inserts on both sides of the ears to protect them, but if you roll them or stack them on their side, they will break. Make sure, again, that whenever you install the clutch, you uh, match up the paint marks with the cover. Another good uh, thing is to open, if you're going to ship out a clutch on a truck line from your, from your store, make sure you open it up and check for breakage at that point. Broken covers can be replaced if you break them for a third of the price of a brand new clutch.